The San Gabriels are just beautiful sage all over. It's sacred, it's magical. Time stops in this place. You can go back to the way that your ancestors lived for thousands of years. That reconnection can happen just by sitting on a rock. This is Cowboy Cologne. I like Cowboy Cologne, it smells so good. The diversity of not only the ecosystems, but the people that come here, it reflects LA. So regardless of income, once you're here, you become equal, right? And nature sort of embraces you with that love. I'm Roberto Morales, I go by Rob. I am the campaign manager for the Outdoor Sparrow Conservation Program. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> like nice and cold. When you look at the data, the highest rates of childhood diabetes and obesity are in low-income communities of color that don't have nearby nature. In the same communities, you have uh, like a clean air, like a clean water. So these frontline communities are the ones that deserve to have the best access for their mental and physical health. I think now the Outdoors for All work, it's more important than ever in the conservation work. And it's a reason why Outdoors for All is very much tied to the conservation campaign of the Sierra Club. The recognition that creating greater and equal access, especially for low-income communities of color, is gonna build a more powerful movement. It's gonna build the next generation of environmental leaders that wanna protect not only our local public land, but protect the planet. Now more than ever, I think this is our chance to really diversify the way that we go about the conservation work. These communities are the ones that are bearing the impact of climate change. They're the ones that can guide us to uh, protect these places, to connect the dots, you know, create these intersections between the environmental issues that are happening in the city and the environmental issues that we have here with conservation. Access to nature, it's definitely a civil right, it's a human right. It is a right for people to have clean water for their health, clean air, and access to open space for their mental health and for their physical health as well. Like that's how important it is to our lives. These are public lands, these are for everybody. 